we've got to get um, uh, bigger and stronger on the edge of our defense, uh, more athletic on the edge of our defense. I think those are, those are two absolutely crucial needs for us moving forward after, after this class. And then on the offensive side of the ball, we'll only take about five or six more quarterbacks next year. I think we'll be all set. Um, but uh, the defensive needs are, are pretty apparent as we move forward in 2011 and then uh, balance out the skill positions uh, on the offensive side of the ball. We got time. You got to have time. I mean, uh, two months is not enough time to, to, um, to get the kind of guy that I want at the University of Notre Dame. You, you need time to build the relationship. You need time to evaluate transcripts. You need time to make sure that they're the right fit uh, in our community, in our campus. Um, and, and we've got the time to do that. Um, I think we've got our system in place in terms of our recruiting system. That's absolutely crucial. Um, and, and, and now our coaches know their geographical areas, Eric. And I, I think now it's not a scramble. Uh, we have clearly identified prospects for 2011 that we have, um, we had um, conversations today um, uh, with a number of juniors uh, and recreated the signing day uh, essentially for them uh, with those phone calls today and, and offering scholarships to the University of Notre Dame and, and really getting them to think, hey, the culmination of this in the next 365 days is going to be you signing your national letter of intent to come to the University of Notre Dame. So th that's really the most important thing. Yeah, that um, you know you can go into any school in the country, any school, um, and they want the head coach to walk through their halls at Notre Dame. They want him to visit with the principal. They want him uh, to be visible in their school because there's such a respect uh, for the University of Notre Dame. And um, I don't know that I f knew that, um, how strong that was, whether it's at St. Francis uh, in Pasadena, California, uh, or whether it's in uh, New Jersey. Um, I was really, I don't want to say taken aback, but um, the Notre Dame brand is alive and well. Well, I, I think, that, again, we're going to recruit the very best players out there. If they happen to have four or five stars, beautiful. I'll, that's great. Um, it, it's really still going to be about um, they have to hit six things for us. One, they've got to make profile. Um, two, they've got to have the academics. Three, we, we, we have to clear their medical history. That, that, that's tough to do in six weeks, to get all the MRIs, to, get, to make sure that they don't have debilitating injuries that's going to come back to hurt you later. Um, they've got to have the academics. They've got to be socially uh, a young man that we trust. And finally, they've got to have the right character. So, you know, if, if you're looking at, you know, those areas, um, it takes time to hit home runs in all those areas. I don't want any red flags in those areas, and time allows you to get to that.